everybody, Mr. Boma from Mr. Boma's Balloons, and today I am going to the Angels game. So I've been making rally monkeys for myself and the people I'm going with, um, and this is the original monkey design that I posted here on YouTube. I love this design except for one thing, and that is this hole in the middle of his back. I kind of was looking for a way of making a, a bubble that would go straight down the center of his back and attach somehow to the middle of his head. But I was struggling with how to attach it there to the head until I realized that I could attach it to the eyes. So these two bubbles here on the eyes are the end of this balloon right here that's going down the center of the back. Um, and so this is Monkey 2.0. I call this Baby Monkey because he's got the great big eyes like a baby. Um, it's a slightly smaller version of this. It does not have the abs uh, and the chest, although you can make it that way if you want. You can add those. Uh, I choose not to, um, but you can do it. Um, so you are going to need two mocha, a scrap of blush, and a scrap of white. And let's go ahead and get started. Okay, uh, for the baby monkey, we need just a little bit of white. So I've got uh, a partial balloon here. We're just going to use very little of that. We're going to use maybe a third of a blush and then to mocha. Um, you can choose whatever colors you want, really. Uh, just be aware that the darker color is going to be the pupils of the eyes. So if you choose a red for the pupils, uh, he might look a little creepy. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. We're going to start with the white. And we're just, like I said, we're just going to use the very end of this, just very little. We're going to make two pinch twists. So I'm going to do this by making two bubbles of about equal size, hopefully equal size. Okay. Two bubbles of equal size. I'm going to lock them together. And then I'm going to take the balloon and I'm going to wrap it through the crease between them. And I'm going to twist the balloon as I go. And I'll wrap it around there probably twice. And what you end up with is two pinch twists like that. You can break off the rest. Just like that. Okay, I am going to take one of my mochas now. And I'm going to leave myself about a five-ish finger tail. And I'm going to do this same thing with the mocha, but I'm going to make the bubbles much, much smaller. As small, really, as I can. So see how small that bubble is? See if I can get a second one that small. This might take some practice. Um, if you end up like I did with two bubbles that are not quite the same size, go ahead and let that first one untwist, and then split what you've got so that you can try and get two that are the same size. Okay, I think that's pretty good. It's okay if they're slightly different. Okay, lock them together, and then again I'm going to twist the balloon through the crease between them a couple of times so that I end up with two little pinch twists. Okay. Um, I'm now going to squeeze out the slack on this a little bit. Okay, squeeze the air out so that I have a little bit of slack so that I can attach them right there to the eyes and then let the air back into that slack. And that should hold it. If you find that this is not holding well, then take the balloon and wrap it all the way around once. Just like we did before, take it through the crease all the way around and that will hold those in place. Um, I'm seeing here that the nozzle is kind of getting in the way. I'm going to stretch the nozzle to the back as well and that will help hold it in place. So those are the eyes. Um, you can see that those came out slightly different sizes. That's fine. It, it adds to the cute factor, really. Okay, we're go actually going to set that aside now. We'll come back to that in a bit. We're going to take our blush. Okay. 
put just a pump or two in there. This is going to be the ears on the front of the face. So we're going to make a pinch twist for an ear. We're going to come about, I would say, three and a half fingers for the front of the face. And then another pinch twist for the other ear. And break off the rest. If you would like to do a chest and abs like on the other monkey that I've got here on YouTube, you can leave that attached and you can make a chest and abs. Uh, but on this baby monkey, I usually don't. Okay, so we'll get rid of that. Take the other mocha or whatever dark color you happen to be using. And we're going to leave ourselves, so oh, let me burp that a little bit. Leave a five or six finger tail on that. This is going to be the main body. We're going to start with one of the arms. So I'm doing a small bubble for the thumb and then a largish pinch twist for the hand. And now this monkey has shorter arms than the other monkey. So we're going to put a little bend there. We're coming up two and a half fingers, putting a bend, and then another two and a half fingers about. So we end up with an arm that's like the size of my palm, maybe a little bit longer since it's bent. Attached to one of the ears, doesn't matter which one. Come across the back, match those two. And then we're going to go we're going to go back across, but we want this bubble to be longer so that it arches a little bit. Like that. Okay. Now that little spot right there, that's where our eyes are going to go. So coming in push it through so in the front that's what you have in the front okay see that okay now we are going to come back about a hands width with both balloons twist them together now you're going to have one balloon that's really long has uh, quite a bit more room than the other. Take the shorter of the two balloons and you're going to match this bubble here on the other side. So that was a little bit more than four fingers. So I think about like that. Okay, so I'm matching the bubble and then I'm going to attach that to the other ear. Just like that. Okay, now I'm going to make the other arm and hand. Arm the same as the first arm, large pinch twist, small bubble, pop off the rest. You don't want that mess hanging off there, you can cut it off. Let's see if I can pull it off. That's not cooperating. Okay, there we go. So pull off that excess or cut it off if you have scissors. With the other balloon in the back, we need to make the monkey butt. So we're going to do two pinch twists. If you find that um, you don't have enough room at the end here, um, you can just do one pinch twist then. You don't have to do two. But I like two because then you have the monkey butt and kids like the monkey butt. Okay, we're going to do the back legs are about a three finger, three and a half finger bubble for the leg. We're going to do a smaller bubble for one of the feet, another smaller bubble, and then we're going to match that bubble here. Whoa! Like that. And the rest of that balloon is the monkey's tail. So go ahead and curl it around, give it a squeeze, massage it a little bit to give it a bit of a curl.
Now we're going to take our Sharpie or whatever marker you happen to use. We're going to do a couple of nostrils. And you can do whatever kind of smile you want. I'm going to give him a little bit of a, a smirky half smile. And that is Baby Monkey. Alright, hope you like it. And uh, I will see you next time. Thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.